10 to 8 at 6 on your side. Good evening, everyone. I'm Rod Carter. Thanks so much for joining us on this Saturday night. Today is the unofficial start of spring break for many beach cities across the state of Florida, and people are rushing out to enjoy some fun in the sun. But a warning tonight, enjoy it, but do so safely. It in your side. Food plug. Guys, Boba Cup in Tampa. I got you. I got you guys with another one. Spring break is around the corner, and the weather today is so hot, like in, in such a long time that we had to come here to get refreshed. If you guys want to get refreshed with some boba, if you like boba, it's an Asian drink. If you guys don't know, come here. This spot is amazing. They offer this cup where it's two cups in one. Perfect. They have these screens where you can order your stuff from. They have the whole list on here. This is cool. They do have a lot of options to offer. Just come check it out. I highly recommend it. Five out of five. I just got a new one that I haven't tried before. I hope I like it. They have so much. That's the double cup I'm talking about. It's a split cup. That's what it's called. Thank you. I only got this one because I don't I've never had it, but I wanted to try it. She said I had to shake it to create the galaxy thing, so you can actually go like this because it's like a bug. I got something about a galaxy oh a galaxy limeade. Comes with a lime in there somewhere. Oh it's right there. Never had it, but it looks cool. I got mini boba because mini boba is dope. She got this avocado drink. Comes with an actual like avocado looking thing on the top, but it's not real. Okay, we're about to go to the beach right now. Since I said it's almost spring break, people are going crazy already for this weather. So, so there's heavy traffic right now to clear water in general. So we're going to have a very hard time getting back to Clearwater Beach. See how long it takes us. It's 2.02 right now. And we got to go s exactly straight to Clearwater Beach. I expect it to be a very long drive. On our way here, like, there was traffic all 275, Golf to Bay. And it's not, like I said, it's not even spring break yet. But it's hectic out here in these streets. Ooh, got him. These are the times it's giving me to go to Clearwater Beach. It's 118, an hour 30, an hour 32. 115. Where'd you get 115? I got 118. Basically, that's the first one. Yeah. Starting route to Clearwater Beach. Oh, look at the look at the red all the way at Clearwater Beach. Where'd it go? Oh my God. 275. Look at this traffic already. It's heavy, and we're nowhere near Clearwater yet. You're supposed to be going 80, 90 right here. We're only going 35, 40. Yo. Them on, um Oh my god. Instagram. I follow this page on Facebook, right? It's about Clearwater Beach. It's strictly Clearwater Beach. I see people every day post how they come to Clearwater Beach and they stay at the hotels and they enjoy their time so much and it's like so beautiful. A lot of people call it paradise. But for somebody that lives here, I clearly don't see it as a paradise, especially around these times when these like spring break, summer, because it gets just very hectic. It's not pleasant or like fun for us that live here because we have to deal with this traffic i see where they're coming from because it's like somewhere you've never been or don't go too often you just see it as a whole different place and it's like so amazing because i i've acted like that when i go to like tennessee new york so i understand them but i just personally hate since i live here how this traffic gets so crazy when it when the weather even gets slightly hot everybody just runs out of their houses and goes to the beach like it's the last day on earth it's just unbelievable yeah i'm gonna experience that right now for like the first time in so many months it has not been like this beautiful of a day in so long here in florida it's crazy that's why everybody's heading to the beach it's been like that since uh friday so that's why everybody's just scramming to the to the beach it is really hot i don't know Oh, it says 89 degrees outside. It's more than 89. It's about 95. We've made it to um, 
Court Street and we were gonna have to turn left down here because this traffic is not gonna move at all look they're all getting out to turn left because this traffic is not gonna move at all whatsoever that's how traffic bad that's how bad traffic is out right now I was gonna go straight but I'm not even gonna deal with it because it's not gonna move at all if you're not from Clearwater you don't know these ways how to get there but we're cutting all these people by a whole bunch literally we're moving and if i could show you the traffic on that side is stopped it's completely frozen in time yo we're taking these back streets we're cutting them all off we're literally going to be at the at the start of the bridge and then we can just start from there but doing this is taking off a lot of time so we're going to be so good i bet there's a bunch of boats and kayaks and stuff on the water right now i can already i can already see it like this weather is so perfect to be in the water right now and we're finally here this is the start of the clearwater causeway 256 yo 256 traffic out the ass all the way back we're gonna be here for a while so far we got kentucky in the house and then we got washington we believe it's washington we don't know we got indiana we see new york but not right now uh, recently so but i'm pretty sure new york's in the house so we know that one for sure they're always here we got pennsylvania i have i have to see texas that's a rare one texas is really rare here oh <laughs> i was just saying that that's rare we just saw texas yo i i got that yo i see i know what's coming up new york's coming up indiana indiana have like, we already seen that one again again we finally made it to clearwater beach and i beat the google clock time it gave us 318 i'm here by 315 so beat that google i know how to drive but look at all these cars. <laughs> look at all these cars. We picked up my mom. That's what we came for. Finally. Let's go back. Minnesota. And then we got Maryland in the house. We got Tennessee. We got Jacksonville. We got Miami. Iowa. We got Iowa. We got Ocala. We got... Florida. That's uh, Miami Dade. If I'm saying right, it's three and three, like three something hours later, and the traffic is still going on. If they're not going for the beach, they're definitely going for the sunset now. Check this out. We're not even halfway up, and there's still mad day. traffic. We're going back for the sunset if we even find a parking spot. Sunset's coming down real quick. A car out, yo. That is the weirdest wrap I've ever they seen on a car. A I don't think that's professional then. No. It's, a white person. <laughs> it's I can't tell what kind of car it is. <laughs> that's so weird. That's like the weirdest wrap ever. It was like swirls and it was white and black. I like this view once you're coming down from the bridge this view just looks amazing you just oversee everything it looks so cool go 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 oh pier 60 famous pier 60. oh pulled over got him Hello, beach walk. Yeah, a lot full, yo. That is a lot of people. No, there's no point. I wonder what this is gonna be. Of course, probably another hotel. What am I talking about? <laughs> I don't think there's no point on going anymore. It's gone. Completely gone. I totally missed that.
I missed it all. I'm so upset. I just missed all the sunset. That's very depressing. I don't even know where she parked. I literally got down just to try and catch it, but I did not get anything. Well, that was my weekend, guys. I hope you guys liked that. I think we're going to just leave it here because I don't think there's much else to do. So thank you guys for watching. Until next time. Deuces. I didn't catch anything.